Something you might not know about Canada. Hey Canada, it's Maestro again. Before the break, I promise to let you know about a lost community that continues to be inspirational. Throughout the early 19th century, black loyalists fleeing the American Revolution in the War of 1812 found their way to Halifax. Residents of what became known as Africville found land, opportunity, and an ongoing battle with racism. Residents never received proper roads, street lamps, water, or electricity. And when a garbage dump was imposed on a self-contained community, its fate was sealed. The site was declared a slum, and from 1964 to 1967, residents had to relocate by city dump trucks while the first African-Canadian community was razed to the ground. Not a proud legacy. But the African-Canadian community has used Africville as an inspiration for great art, music, theater, and film, including Joe Seeley's 1997 June Award-winning Africville Suite. Proving that great shame could also lead into great art, and that's something you might not know about Canada.